Welcome back, fancy girls. If you're new here, hi, my name is Blanca, and if you're coming back, then welcome back. And if you haven't done so already, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell button so you don't miss out when I post a new video. So in today's video, we're gonna go ahead and do a small, <laughs> small, but kind of big Easter haul because I have some things here that I've been collecting for about a week and then I have some items that I do have from last year. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to go through all of it as fast as I can. I am going to try and link everything for you girls, but most of these items I do get from Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, and Ross. So if there's anything that you want specifically, you can always send me a message through Instagram. I'll go ahead and leave it right here so you girls can go ahead and follow me there throughout my shopping journeys because every day is like a shopping journey for me usually i wake up take my kids to school and then after that i'm either processing orders for my business or i am out shopping so that's kind of became my new daily thing so i'm gonna go ahead and start this video so let's get right into it the first thing that i bought is this pillow right here and i did forget to mention we are in a different area of my house today clearly we're in the kitchen because i did put everything here in the kitchen and i'm gonna go ahead and insert a video towards the end so you girls can see everything is literally all laid out here next to me so like i said we're in a different area today let's just roll with it okay so this pillow super cute it has all the bunnies now moving on i got this cute little bunny here i'm sure you girls saw him or her on the intro she's so cute has the little pink ears the little pink nose and the little tongue so adorable i'm obsessed i'm just gonna go ahead and put everything behind me or wherever i can because this is a lot this is a small little tree that I found. It has all the little Easter eggs. And I do plan on painting them. I'm not sure yet. I kind of like the way it looks like this, but I might paint all of them this same shade of pink. I also did get this gorgeous pink blanket from Ross and it was $9.99. And when I saw it, I was actually looking for a Radon blanket but the shade of pink that it had I didn't like it that much when I found it so when I saw this one at Ross and it had the little outline of the little rabbits I was like okay I'll just get this one instead super cute this cute little Easter blessing egg I got from I believe home goods and I'm not sure where I'm gonna put this one yet but I did grab it because it was pink obviously and then I also got this cute little truck that says Happy Easter on it as well with the little Easter bunny right here with the little tail. Super cute. Up next, I got this cute bowl and it has little poker dots in pink. And then what sold me on it was this little rabbit right here. And again, I don't know what I'm going to do with this one. I'll probably put candy in it and put it in my coffee bar i'm not sure yet okay these ones are so cute so it's a salt and pepper shaker and i don't really use either of them but when i saw them i thought they would look super cute on like a little tear tray so when i do finish my coffee station i'll go ahead and show you girls like a small little video of it so you girls can see everything but these ones are adorable like look at them the little tails up next is this huge happy easter sign and i'm not sure about it yet just because it has a lot of colors going on and i don't want all of the colors in my coffee station just because i feel like it's going to be too much for it so i'm only going to be doing like white and pink 
So I'm not sure about this one yet. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep it. If anything, I'll put it somewhere else around the house. So here is this other one. It says hippity hoppity. And this one is more like the theme I'm going for. So like the pink with the white. And this one was $9.99 from Home Goods as well. And this one is Ray Dunn as well. So if you girls are interested in this one, you could run to your Home Goods and try to snag it because usually all of the Ray Dunn stuff just sells out way too quick. Here I have this super cute um, bunny. Like um, these are called kitchen towels. <laughs> For a moment there, I forgot, but I do have a lot of gray in my house. So this one is gray. And then I wanted it to be very like simple in the kitchen, but it also has the bunnies. So I found them super cute. Up next, if you girls saw during Christmas time, everybody went crazy with the nutcrackers. So when I saw this guy, I was like, this looks just like a nutcracker, but in the Easter style so i grabbed it and i do have like three of them but i'm not sure what i'm going to do with them but they were pink and they're just so cute it says happy easter right here adorable and i also grabbed this one right here that's holding the carrot again i don't know what i'm gonna do with all of these easter stuff i'm planning on decorating my easter table my easter table my coffee table so i'm going to turn it into easter i did decorate it for valentine's day so i'm going to be decorating it for easter this year and i've never done it before this is the first time i had a coffee table so let's see how it goes but i'm pretty sure this is gonna be cute because look at how adorable this is like i couldn't pass up on him this next item is from hobby lobby and i'm not sure if you'll be able to find this one it was $7.99 and I got this one early in February so they were already putting out their Easter stuff. I know it's hard to read it here because it's backwards and it is cursive but it says Easter in cursive letters and it's pink so I do love that as well. This next item I got from TJ Maxx and it was $4.99 and these are like um, lip balms. So kind of like chapsticks and I'm always carrying this in my bag and I mostly fell in love with this one right here and this one right here as well. It has a little bunny with hearts. So I'll probably give this to, to my daughter and then I'll keep this too because they're just so stinking cute. I love it. Back to Hobby Lobby. I went there yesterday because I needed the bows on this little like cupcake um, picks. So you put this on top of the cupcakes. And when I saw the little like um, fluffy things and the ears, I was like, okay, I have an idea what I'm going to do with them. And although I only needed the two pink bows, I was like, okay, I need to have them. And if you were wondering for what I might need two random pink bows, it's for this guys right here and if you go to target and you know about their seasonal items they do sell out quickly so by the time you watch this video if you really like this cute little easter bunnies they are ceramic then make sure you run to your closest target and go check their seasonal um area so that way you girls can snag this ones they were only five dollars and they're so cute. So I'm going to be switching out their white bows for pink. And I'm going to either put them on my tear tray or my coffee station. But they are adorable. I also got this cute jar from Hobby Lobby. And I'm not sure about it yet. I might put marshmallows in here. Um, I'm not sure because I'm not in love with the bunny. I feel like it's like a weird looking bunny. But we're gonna do something out of it so i might keep it i'm not sure yet now the item that i'm going to show you i've been looking for i want to say the whole month of february because it's this super cute garland and 
they had a lot of garlands at TJ Maxx and Home Goods, but I didn't want to have too many colors. So when I saw this one, it was white and pink. And it does have uh, blue and purple at the top, but I don't mind that because I feel like the pink and the white is the ones that are showing the most. So here's what it looks like, how it's going to look like in the back. This item here is so cute. It's this cute little bunny with a bow and a pink dress. This one was $9.99 from Hobby Lobby. And again, I did find her in early February. So if you want to go and check your nearest um, Hobby Lobby, you might be able to find it. And I also grabbed this one. This one was $3.99. And it does have like... um wire inside on his ears so you can like twist them or turn them however you want super cute this one right here is from the dollar store and it has blue with the pink ears with the little pink nose and i'm still not sure what i'm gonna do with this one either but when i saw it it was only 125 as you girls know they are no longer a one dollar shop so I did grab this one though. This other sign right here, it says, Some Bunny Loves You. And it's so adorable. This one was $5.99. And it's just like a little sign, so it just stands. Like I said, $5.99. This two little trees right here, this one's white and this one's pink. I wanna say it's more of like a peach color, not pink. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep both of them yet. I have to see what I end up doing with my decorations. But again, I think I'm going to paint the little Easter eggs on these to pink and they were both $7.99. Up next is another Ray Dunn item, to no surprise, is this cute little bunnies. And this is for like your salt and your sugar, I wanna say. so. I don't usually have this out on display, so I'll probably put it on my uh, coffee station. I'm not a big fan of the wood color, so I'm either going to paint it white or I'm just going to remove them from there. But most likely, I think I'm going to paint this white. The next item that I'm going to show you girls, I have not seen anywhere again after I purchased them. I got these ones at Home Goods, and they are um, like Fox cookies, like they're fake cookies. I'm not sure if I said that right, but there's four of them. And so these are just decorations. So I'm going to go ahead and take them out and put them in like a cute tray just for like display photos and things like that. But what I love about them is that you can use them year round because they're not real cookies so again if you want you can go ahead and check your local home goods and see if you find them but they're so adorable i did also get this milk chocolate eggs and this one have the cereal inside and so they are kind of crunchy and i love that so when i saw it at first all i saw was pink so i looked at it because it was a pink box but then when I saw that it was milk chocolate with cocoa creams and cereal, I was like, okay, I'm grabbing them. So I did already dig into them, so ignore that. <laughs> and also from, um, this one's from TJ Maxx. I grabbed this Jordan Almonds like um, pastel color eggs. And it is already open because my oldest child, which is my husband, he digged into them yesterday. So today I went to TJ Maxx again and I ended up grabbing another one. They're not the same. This one's actually just, um, I guess, chocolate eggs. It says malted eggs, but it's still the same like idea. It has pastel color eggs. So he was like really obsessed with this one. He said they taste really good. So I went back looking for them, but they didn't have them anymore. So I found these ones and obviously it's the same packaging. So I'm hoping this one tastes good as well. Another item that I grabbed 
that is to eat is this little bunny's marshmallows and it does have like a shade of rainbow colors on the wrapping but the bunnies inside are just pink with little white ears and a white little tail and when i first saw them i passed up on them and i couldn't find them again but i went to um tj maxx a few days ago and they had this one and i grabbed one for me and i grabbed one for my friend because once you see something you like at either tj maxx home goods or hobby lobby just grab it because once you come back it might not be there now the item i'm gonna show you girls it's this little bowl and i have no intentions of putting food in here but it does says bunny love and when i saw it i was like that is so cute so i'm going to remove this and i'm going to leave it outside with like some candy and my kids love candy so i feel like this is super cute it says bunny love this video is going to be so long and i still have so much more to show you girls but look at this one right here so this one i actually bought the mug first which i'm going to show you girls and later on but when i saw this one i had to have it so it's just a jar it has the little bunny feet and the little bunny toe and this one was 7.99 from home goods I'm going to go ahead and move into all the mugs that I have so far for Easter because I feel like every time a different season comes around, I have a whole bunch of mugs. Like for Christmas, I had a whole bunch. For Valentine's Day, I had a whole bunch. And Easter is no different. So here's the little mug that I was telling you girls that go with that other item that I just showed you. This one was $5.99 from Home Goods as well. And it has the little ears and the little feet and as well the little tail so here's the mug super cute the next item i'm showing you girls is a mug as well and i was looking for this one everywhere um one of my friends from the pain community posted this one it says bunny kisses and easter wishes and when i saw it i was like that is the cutest mug i've seen for easter and this one was actually the first one that i saw that i wanted and I was hunting for it literally every day. And I finally found it at TJ Maxx for $4.99. This one is from the Carrot Patch Cottage Company. So if you girls like this one, try either Marshalls or TJ Maxx because that's where these ones were released at. This next mug I found at Ross. And I have a story behind this one because I have a friend that lives in Texas and she found this mug for me at the store and she bought it for me but then my other friend that lives here in florida she went to our nearest store here by my house and she told me that she saw this mug and it was so cute so she bought it and there was another one there so i went the following day in the morning and it was there waiting for me so i did up end up purchasing this one and my friend i think she either returned the one she got me or ended up keeping it but this one's super cute and it has a cute little bow so it says bunny love this next mug right here as well i was searching up and down it says bunny buns this one was actually 12.99 so a little bit more expensive but this one is ray done and it has a little bunny like if it's inside of the mug with little pink um paws or feet or whatever you want to call it and when i saw this one online i knew i needed to have it so once i saw it at tj maxx i definitely snagged it because i knew i wasn't gonna see it again the next mug that i'm showing you girls i actually um got this one from tj maxx and i actually got a picture from my friend um, she was looking for this mug and I saw it today at the store and they had two of them. So I sent her the picture to verify that it was the one she wanted. So I ended up getting one for her. And when I saw it in person, it had pink inside. It had pastel colors with a lot of pink and the little bird on it. So I fell in love with the handle. So I had purchased it because it was cute. <laughs> 
this one says hop to it and it has the little white bunny on a pink easter egg and it's from Raydon. this one was 14.99 and when i saw it i had never seen this one before even online so i had to snatch it you girls already know if it has pink i need it in my life it was too cute i also got this uh garland from the dollar spot and it has a little bunny in the end and i mostly got it because my friend needed something like this for her tear tray and she wasn't sure if she was going to find it in her hometown so i bought it for her but she ended up making her own so i'm not sure if i'm going to keep this one just because it has a lot of blue and purple but then again i do have that other garland that i showed you girls so i feel like it goes well together so i might keep it also yesterday i went to home goods and i saw this baby right here and i had already seen it in pictures because like i said i have a lot of friends that are into pink and we are constantly shopping so we send each other pictures all the time so my friend had already sent me this guy right here He's holding all of these macaroons and he's just so cute. Has the little pink nose. This one was $14.99 and there was two of them. Thank God because I told her I'm going to grab one just for you. But then I kept walking around the store and I had both of them in my car and I was like, I can't leave this guy behind. So he came home with me. So this one's mine and I already have my friends stored away because i'm going to ship it to her but how can you not fall in love look at him the next two items i'm showing you girls i bought them separately but my intention was to have both of them together but i wasn't sure because i'm gonna show you girls the first one that i found it was this one right here and it says bunny love and it has a little bunny and then it has the pink topper if you girls are into Raydon or if you girls know anything about Raydon, it's super hard to find these items if you don't go early. Sometimes you might see it later on because a lot of people are not after it. But if there's something that the Raydon people want to collect, you will not find this at all. So I was super happy when I found this one. But I had a little dilemma because I didn't know what I wanted to pair it with. So today I did go to Home Goods. This is where I got this one. This one was $14.99. So I went to Home Goods today and I found this one. So it says Cotton Tell Cutie. And I was like, okay, I feel like this two will go good together. Even though I wanted this one and this one to be the same height, I couldn't find anything that will match perfectly. So this too will do another thing that i'm currently looking for are measuring cups and again if you are into radon or you know anything about radon measuring cups are super hard to get so when i saw this cute little bunny ears measuring like they're not measuring cups they're more of like um they look like spoons. This ones are more of measuring cups. This ones look like spoons. They both came together, but I did break them apart. They were $9.99. And I'm actually going to use the little spoons as like a, like a spoon, like for my chocolate or my coffee, like to spin it around because they're so cute. So I'm going to use it the opposite way. I'm going to use it this way. So I can see the little ears. You girls will see. If you follow me on Instagram, I'll post pictures. Back to the Easter Nutcrackers. I found these guys. And I do have another pink one and another white one. I'm still not sure which color I'm going to end up doing. Because I feel like this pink is just too much pink. Like this one looks cuter to me because it's white and then it has a little pink nose so i might change the bow to pink 
but I don't know. I kind of like this one too. So I'm not sure yet. I'm going to play with my coffee bar and I'll let you girls know which one I end up keeping or I'm pretty sure you girls will see the video when I post it. So super cute. Another item that was super hot for December or Christmas time was gingerbread house. And I did buy a gingerbread house for Valentine's Day but i didn't do a haul for valentine's day so that's why i decided to do one for easter so that way you girls could see everything so look at this little gingerbread house so it has the pink roof and it's a blue house and it does light up so i'm not sure if you girls can see it right now because it's daytime but i'm pressing it it does light up and it has a little bunny outside. So when I saw it, I was like, that is so cute. So, you know, I'm just a little girl here in love with everything pink. So obsessed. This is so cute. This give me like little dollhouse vibes. So cute. You girls are probably like, wow, that's a lot of Easter stuff, but we're not done yet. Let me show you girls another bunny that I bought. It was this chunky little bunny and it is a canister so this is super cute like it has a little hard nose i'm thinking of putting a bow on it but again i'm not sure if i'm keeping all of the easter stuff because i'm going to play with all my decorations and some of these items might go back so i'm not sure yet about this one but it has little dimples all around and it's so chunky moving on i have little salt and pepper bunnies again with the little white basket and i'm not sure if it's going with my aesthetic but they're super cute so when i saw them i did grab them but now that i'm looking at them i'm not sure because i did find the other ones so here are the other ones and then here are these ones so i kind of like these ones more i'm not sure yet back to the measuring cup dilemma i found this cute little measuring cups and they go perfect with this jar that i just showed you girls so they're kind of like matching so when i saw these ones i couldn't pass up on them the first time that i found them one of them was broken and this one does have a little chip like right here i'm not sure if you girls could see that but you could barely see it and they're still super cute so i did up and they grabbing this ones and they're 9.99 the next few items that i'm going to be showing you girls are actually from the dollar store and the last item that i'm going to show you girls is actually something that i own since last year so i'm not sure if you'll be able to find that one but let me get right into it i got this bubble gum eggs and they look like this and i feel like these are going to look cute in my little um bubble gum machines so i'll show you girls what they look like once i do my coffee table again and i also grabbed this bunny tails so i did grab two of them and i did also grab this little easter eggs and i might paint them i'm not sure yet if i'm going to keep them I obviously just bought them for the pink ones, but I'm not sure if I'm going to do a little Easter tree just because I already want to take down my Valentine's Day tree. So I'm not sure yet. I might keep them and do like a small tree. I'm not sure yet. And then I also did grab the carrots. So I might use this for either photo drops or for my tear tray. I'm not sure yet, but here's some carrots. All right, girls, this is the end of the video. So last but not least, this is my Easter little basket that has a bow on it. And I did get this one last year and it is Ray Dunn. This one was $14.99. And when I first bought these, um, I used to buy a lot of like stuff for the house that had staying, sayings on them, but I didn't know it was Ray Dunn at first till I met my friend and that's when all the addiction for radon began 
but this one is my Easter basket. I'm not sure if you'll be able to find it this year, but she's so cute. That is it for this video. I'll go ahead and insert the video of everything so you girls could have like a small recap of everything that I just showed you. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and don't forget that I'm going to be announcing the giveaway winner in March. So that is it for today. I hope you girls enjoyed it and I'll see you girls in the next video. Bye!